Um, Sean, you would have watched Sterling as a fan and watched Robbie Keane, I'm sure, support him when you were younger. What's it like now that you're watching or you're being coached by him now from the sidelines as part of mixed team mm. and the responsibility of qualifying is, is on your shoulders as a player now? How does that feel? Yeah, it's, um, it's an amazing feeling, you know. It was my first time meeting Robbie coming in Sunday. Um, and even chatting to him, he brings that all about, all about him. Um, and you want to learn from him straight away. Even in the space of the last couple of days, him giving you tips here and there. Um, it's just great to see. It's great to see. just great to be involved of, you know, a player of his uh, stature. And um, I've no doubt that, you know, even in the space of these 10 days, being involved with Robbie, that will probably go st- come from strength to strength and hopefully, you know, kick on as a player because, you know, he's... A player where you want to look up down everything what you want to be. Um, I think his goals speak for himself. 68 goals for Ireland, um, and hopefully you know these next couple of games. Hopefully I can kick st- kick on my my international career. Mick went to see you playing against QPR first, and then he said he went to see you against play against Millwall. He said QPR game he wasn't impressed at all, but then he went to see you playing against Millwall, and he said he thought you were a really fantastic player. Can you kind of see? Where he might have had the different perspectives on both games. Well, to be fair, QPR was my probably my first start in a couple of months since that. You know, the hamstring injury against Northern Ireland. Um, I played off the left as well, so um, but like I played, I played off the left on numerous occasions this season. But to be fair, I was only getting back into the groove of things, and um, I probably probably say so myself that I didn't particularly have a good game. But yeah, against Millwall, I think I was seeing me at. You know, near my best, um, we won 3-1 and scored a goal. Um, I think Millwall kind of, you know, fell into our our trap and, you know, we hit him on the counter-attack and, you know, I really impressed that day. I um, was really happy with myself and even since then now I felt that I've kicked on a little. Um, probably would like to score a couple more goals, but, you know, for me it's just about finishing out games and, you know, I say fully, fu- fully, f- sorry, fully fit for and now to the end of the season. When I'm playing, when I'm fully fit, I think my record speaks for itself. But I think what I have put there shows you that I don't think I've done myself any justice. Um, I've only had one start and obviously a couple of cameos, but you know, when the time I started actually this time last year against Turkey, I didn't particularly play well at all and didn't play up to the standards I set myself. Um, but yeah, given the opportunity, um, I think I can bring goals. Um, and I suppose these are the type of games or a striker where you're probably going to give, be given opportunities to, to put the ball in the back of the net and, um, you know, I'll, I'll relish that opportunity. 